Hello friends, I just finished reading this book and I have some thoughts. Leo says hi as well. This book, wow you guys. So this is a graphic novel. It's absolutely stunning. Every bit of it, oh my gosh. It gave me chills, absolute chills. To have like, I don't even know how to articulate this properly. This book is the author's life as they tried different identities and saw which one best fit their life and it's just like real life where you try one and maybe it fits and then you try another one later on and it's so real it's so emotional and raw and real because just like actual life you might try one identity and it might fit you for a while or maybe it doesn't and then you find a better like identity that fits you a little bit better and you just kind of navigate through life you know until you find one that feels like home hence the home body <laughs> i cried a lot um while reading this book it w i got emotional like it was pretty bad because i related a lot to some of the shit um with just going through identities and not really fitting into anything, not knowing the right words, and then, f and then finding the right words, and then having that light bulb go off in your head and like, holy shit, I'm not broken. Um, yeah. And I love all the things that it touches on. Like here it goes into like um, visibility, like just having they, them on a lanyard or in your profile or in your email just makes it so visible so that others feel more, you know, that it's out there. This one really got me, like, am I the only one who exists? Fucking vibes. Some of these I want as, like, posters. Like this one, blossoming in an environment where the odds are stacked so immeasur immeasurably against you is a beautiful act of defiance. Like, this, this artwork is gorgeous, and I just want it as a poster in my bedroom. This book is just chef's kiss, um, very emotional for me, and I'm giving it five stars. I would highly recommend this book to everyone, and it's the perfect time to read it during Pride Month.